An impediment such as this on the Lagos Ibadan Expressway equals gridlock that lasts a few hours. It is worse when it is a major one like this. This fully loaded fuel tanker had been pulled off the road on Tuesday when FRSC officials from Ogo State noticed it was leaking. In order to prevent an ignition, traffic is diverted. Choking up the road, leaving many motorists to spend the night on the road. It has taken over 24 hours to restore sanity to this highway. The experience we had with the tanker, which uh, content was leaking, yes, was spilling yesterday. It is the backlog of that uh, problem that we are still experiencing. Remember, it took us some hours before we were able to evacuate the tanker because of the content. It was carrying uh, petrol, so we had to be uh, safety conscious and be very careful in evacuating, which took us some hours. And you know, a problem of uh, even five minutes on this road will create uh, a backlog of uh, that you may, may not be able to, to eradicate in the next 30 minutes. Lagos Ibadan Highway connects all states of the Federation, and when situations like this occur, mostly on the Ogo State end of the expressway, motorists point accusing fingers at poor traffic management. The Federal Road Safety Corps disagrees with this. What we have is, you will realize presently, the construction work is uh, ongoing within the axis of Ogun State. Now, as they are coming from Lagos, they are having three lanes. But when they get to the point of diversion, they have to slow down and align into just two lanes. If you are not ready to obey traffic, if you are driving against traffic, it is an offense, and definitely they are going to uh, made to, to, to be faced, I mean, to face the, the, the law squarely. During an oversight visit to the road in December 2018, the Senate Committee on Works frowned on the slow pace of work, recalling that the budgetary allocation to road infrastructure across the country has risen from 500 billion naira to 600 billion naira in the 2019 budget. Motorists supplying this route may have to wait till 2021 when Julius Berger says the road would be delivered. Loretta Chiogo, Channels Television News.